Um, I like just planting them and helping around the garden and picking them and eating some of them and just helping. My name's Lori and I am the Farm to School Coordinator with the Boys and Girls Club of Carbon County. The mission of the Youth Garden is to increase access to local food, improve nutrition education, and improve uh, the health and lives of kids in the community and their families. We uh, actually started here at the Roosevelt Center before the Roosevelt Center kind of separated off. And so we've been, we've had the Youth Garden here in Red Lodge for Gosh, I think all, oh, over seven years now. I'm Maddie and I'm with the Boys and Girls Club and as of June 1st, the club is the new home to the Farm to School Coordinator position. So uh, this summer is kind of new for us and so far it's been great and we're looking forward to a great school year to come. So as the Boys and Girls Club, we facilitate the Farm to School program, which is in charge of the youth garden. We teach kids through gardening and um, through the youth garden. Um, everything from life skills like gardening to math, science, art projects. Um, and it's really just a great creative space for the kids. I like strawberries because they are red and red's one of my favorite colors. And they're very delicious. And I love celery because it's in salads and I eat salads all the time. My name is Bridget. I'm currently the first grade teacher at Mountain View Elementary, but um, I was also a previous Farm to School coordinator for the Farm to School program and um, have used the Farm to School program as a preschool teacher as well at the Beartooth Children's Center. So the impact that the youth uh, garden has on the students and children of our community is it gives them a, a real world experience watching the plant grow from a seed and sprouting into a plant and then being able to harvest the food. Um, the kids that I work with have the opportunity to come down to the garden and um, tend, to, tend to the garden and also harvest some of the, the produce. And then we take it actually to the cafeteria. And Miss Amy, our cook at the cafeteria, actually utilizes that. And it's so meaningful to the kids when she puts it into the like the salad bar and they say hey i i picked that carrot this morning and then it's in the salad bar so they see that it's not coming from a grocery store it's coming from a place that they utilize every single day or every or every week and so they're able to have that one-on-one -on -one, uh, realistic experience 